be using this plate which I will show you how I will put everything all together it's very easy to do all right guys let's do this welcome back to the vlog today I'm going to show you how I make a very easy um, centerpiece for our upcoming event actually this is gonna be on Saturday it's gonna be a uh, masquerade theme uh, masquerade ball Christmas party I've been looking around and and um, it's very expensive I decided to film it and show it to you guys how I did this um, centerpiece let's start with the tutorial so these are the materials that um, I will be using for this project all of these guys came from the dollar store the Dollar Tree except for my glue gun and the glue sticks that I already have in hand First thing I have different colors of ribbon and then the beads I have the multicolored ones and then um, the silver and the gold ones there's the silver um, I think it comes in a pack of 10 so as you can see I only have uh, the green and the blue here because I already um, used it in the, some of them I have to make six so I bought two packages of the gold the gold and then the silver and then the multicolored this is like Gorilla Glue and I bought two of this for the whole project i am using only this part of this plastic part to hold the mask the diamond wrap ribbon give a little bling bling on um on the centerpiece i want height so what i will do which i will show you later on is to stack them together like this one this plate will actually provide stability for my centerpiece of course you need a mask they comes in different colors and, and of course the glue stick also need scissors first thing that i did was to remove the sticker from the bottom of this glass plate and then i am using a, uh, a generous amount of this super glue it has a very strong smell that i can tell you and then I am also adding the glue stick because I want this centerpiece to be very sturdy and then on the rim of the base that I will put upside down I also put the um, super glue make sure that when you put it guys it is in the center and pressed it not too hard because you don't want to break the glass And then while that is hardening, um, I wanted to add more of the, the glue stick just because I don't want it to move around when, you know, we move the, the centerpiece, when we uh, transport this. And also for added um, sturdiness and security, making sure that this is a solid piece. But don't worry about this guys the glues and everything because um, it will be hidden by these uh, gold beads that I put around the base as you can see here is the closed-up look I put a small dot of um, the glue stick around it and then just pressed it um, around you will not even see it guys I promise just push it like that Trim the beads to the right size and that's all you need to do. So I decided to add another layer of the beads but in silver color and that's what I am doing here. Second layer of silver beads is done. So this is what it looks like with um, three layers of beads in silver and in gold color and for more visual interest I am also going to add this um, silver jeweled ribbon on top of this um, beads for just a little nice touch and um, 
some more bling and I'll show you what it looks like after I cut it to size and um, I add it and I will use a glue stick to attach this um, piece so the next thing I'll be doing is to glue this piece to this to this one and for the seaming this one here I want to make sure that it lines up um, perfectly with this bottom piece put a lot and put more uh, more of this glue stick you have to work very fast on this guys it's not firm enough so I will add more on the side just to hold it in place securely of this glue sticks add more around this part where the first glass meets the bottom glass the top glass meets the bottom glass I'm not gonna leave it like that so plain looking so I will add this shiny ribbon again cut it to a size and then I'll come back and show it to you guys what it looks like I can't even talk today I will push this carefully on the side then I will work on this uh, plastic stick that would hold the mask but I'm just not gonna use it like this plain looking one I'm gonna have to jazz it up a little bit so it'll look like this so from this to this, put a little dot uh, to the very end of this plastic stick and then carefully because the glue stick is hot just press it like that. Wait for at least two seconds and then put your finger there. And then just roll it like this until the whole stick is covered completely with the ribbon color of your choice. Continue doing this and I will show you how I put it all together. I see you can see. And then I will attach it to this, the middle. Make sure it's in the middle of the mask like that. I'm gonna add more ribbon to this um, stick to drape around so it looks pretty. So that's what it looks like with the ribbon on. This is totally optional guys if you um, just want your uh, base to be just all glass and not to put anything on the inside it looks like now guys once I put um, two of the masks in in the um, the vase and then now I'll be adding um, this gold beads around here actually I should have added this one first like you can just hang it however you guys wanted all right guys i'm done with this diy and i think that it came out really good behind me it's over there standing on our counter and i'm finally finished with six of them i decided i can't wait to put it on our table for saturday and uh, see what it looks like with everything at the party so here it is guys very colorful very festive here they are so pretty i have thought that they are all dollar tree pieces i hope you like this tutorial and if you do please leave me a comment down below or a picture and try to make it or recreate it yourself and another thing is the the vase that i made i can reuse it over and over for different parties i can even use it for if there's anybody for for wedding uh, so until next time guys thank you so much for watching bye